I have no problem working with anybody. I don't hold grudges for almost anybody. I just think you more care about the content yet you can generate from the feud, right? Like, honestly. Wait, no. If I set up a debate between you and Bosch, you'd come? So, if, if a lot of people thought it would be very effectively effective for Progressive for you to Vosh to work together again, would you maybe try to make peace with him? I, in yeah, a it's way that wait, hold isn't on. It's content driven. It's always with those people. I have no problem working with anybody. I don't hold grudges for almost anybody. Yeah, that it's, it's always on their end that they don't. But ever you know that's not what I'm saying. Like you know, Vosh has issues with you, and in your manifesto, you basically you you talk a lot about despising him. Mm -hmm. And to be fair, he says the same about you. But if you cared about activism you could try to make actual peace. I just think you more care about the content yet you can generate from the feud, right? Like, honestly. Wait, no. The maximizing no. of content would be working with him. Our duo debates did really well. Um, bringing okay. him onto these like fresh and fit shows would be huge viewership. Um, even debating him with things would be huge viewership. Um, and setting up, and also I make him a better person because he doesn't have anybody to copy takes off of now and he's like getting lost in a lot of shit. So no, I think like we synergize with each other and work really well. Me and Hassan debating would make like really good content. Um, from a content point of view, it makes more sense for us to work together even. So no, but that's just, so he has So do you think this, yeah. them, they are the issue with not working with you? Yeah, of course. of course. Well, of course, I would say that too. But his ex yeah. his excuse is going to be that. Well, can um, I ask directly? Can I ask directly? Destiny, what? if I set up a debate between you and Vosh, you'd come. Yeah, of course. Okay, yeah. excellent. Vosh, the ball's in your court. Well, okay. it's been in his court for like two years. <laughs> but his let his argument is that. Like, let to, me ask you but, this. So yeah. let's say it's twenty twenty four. Mm -hmm. Right, we've got an election to win. Let's say it's Joe Biden again. He's our uh, he's our nominee. Yeah, you know, DGG tried to recruit me to go down to Georgia, I couldn't say yes, because, uh, you know, PACs obviously cannot coordinate with political campaigns. But you know, if I could find a way to, like, get it so outreach to say Majority Report, or Young Turks, and then everyone like Destiny, DGG, Young Turks, Majority Report, we're getting every streamer to put together people to go canvas together for 2024. Would you be willing to give a project like that your thumbs up? Um, I. I, I would tentatively say yes. Um, we considered this before because there was a group, there's actually a group of Vosh people that wanted to come in and canvas and work with us. Um, mm -hmm. I, like if I say no, it's not gonna be because of ideological disagreements. If I said no, it would just be because um, having multiple fan bases trying to come together under the same event might lead sure. to some bad leadership clusterfucky problems. I could yeah. see that. Mm -hmm. Maybe but, like, we could. I wouldn't care say, like, like if they if we wanted yeah. to like cut up Georgia and like oh we should all go to Georgia to canvas. Like I'd have my people, they'd have their people, and the other group of people would have their people. And if we've yeah. got canvassers that are close to Atlanta, let's say that we go that we go to Columbus and they go to Savannah or um, some other place in Georgia, um, Atlanta or whatever. Um, like we, we could send canvassers to other people's groups. That'd be sure. like totally fine. Yeah, I, yeah. But the you cluster could also part, yeah. like split it up, figure out a different swing state. So mm -hmm. DGG goes down to X swing state. We mm -hmm. get Vosh to go over to a Y swing state. So there's no, like, I I just think like that's the kind of I I think that kind of leadership from the top. I think it's like modeling what you want to see in the world. For sure. I think it's sending a message to the Democratic Party because something I don't. Look, let's be clear, like uh, the House of Representatives, like they're probably not calling DGG uh, saying, hey, can you bring me out some volunteers here? You know, if you can raise your profile as someone that can deliver volunteers for people, you know, that gives you real world power, mm -hmm. right? It gives the progressive movement power. Um, you know, it, it says that, look, young people are not just here to bitch on Twitter. You're here to get some stuff done. I think that would be, yeah, I think it'd be a really good moment for all of us to oh, yeah. feel good about going and building something. Yeah, absolutely. Together. Like I said, like we, yeah. like between the three of us, I know we could fill over 5,000 canvassers. This is not sure. even a question. Like, and we could put them almost anywhere in the country too. And yeah. we can get them really, really, really driven. Um, I think in one weekend, my canvassing crew in Georgia knocked 10% of the doors in the state um, that, yep. that had been knocked for that entire campaign. And that was just with my fan base. Like Hassan could probably mobilize five times more people. Um, right. But